obviously at this moment, all our hearts and minds, prayers and thoughts are on Florida. However, with Milton bearing down, if you can do anything else, I highly recommend donating to Habitat.org. Um, they're a great organization, a trustworthy organization, and they'll make sure that they get your donation to where it needs to go to help the people uh, of this coming tragedy. Um, yeah. <laughs> Greetings and welcome back to another uh, fun and exciting episode of the podcast. I'm your host as always, Jason Olivera. Today we've got biscolata. What is biscolata? I have no idea what it was. I was at Ollie's the other day and it stood out to me because it had cream on the inside, a chocolate star on top, and there's just a cookie surrounding it all. So I thought for 89 cents it might be a fun review for us to do together here on the podcast. And if you didn't notice, I'm wearing my very crooked cryptid bit shirt. This was a uh, prototype that did not go out quite the way I hoped it it had but uh my eyes are getting bad and i couldn't you know get it even so i figured I'd, I'd, I'd wear this today and show a little love for cryptid bits with general tidbits if you've never checked out her channel you can check it out right there her channel is phenomenal i've been on there a few times and i look forward to hopefully in the future going back on there again but if you're into cryptids definitely a channel worth checking out but today it's biscalata a lot of bisca so they are filled cookies topped with milk chocolate stars this expires august 16th of next year it was a whopping, oh, what is that? No, say 89 cents. I thought it was 69 cents for a second. So let's bust into the Biscolata and see what they're all about. It reminded me of the Bischoff or the Biscoff, whatever you, however you pronounce it, those kind of like cookie butter or the cookie butter cookies. It seemed like right up that alley. Anywho, the company's name was Stars. All right, let's take a look at this. There it is. Not quite as impressive as what I saw on the front, but you can never expect it to look exactly like the package. That would be like going to McDonald's and ordering like a sandwich off of their menu and then getting it because it's not going to look like that picture. All right. Uh, cross section? Yeah, okay. That way you guys can see the cream in there. Left the chocolate. I'm going to just eat this whole thing because it's a small cookie, and uh, I'll be back with you in just a minute to let you know how I felt about it. I'm also going to check a text message. <laughs> Well, I was not expecting it to be that good. That is really good. Remember that thunky I was talking about? I don't know what video it was. We'll just say this one. I'm pretty sure it was that one, though. It's got that thunk factor in the middle. It's not like a cream or like a... It's not like an Oreo cream. It's not like a liquidy cream. It's definitely got some thunk to it, and I really like that. The chocolate tastes good. The cookie tastes good. Cookie wasn't too hard. Man, I... I I'm trying to find a fault in this so that I, I, I can't give it a 10. I mean, this is just some 89 cent cookie I found at Ollie's. Good stuff, cheap. But, I mean, I'm leaning in that direction because this was that good. It's like a nice combination without being overly sweet, too. If you're not into a cookie that's super sweet, this is pretty good, even though there's chocolate and vanilla cream. I'm assuming it's vanilla cream. Did I say vanilla cream? No, it just says filled. It's filled with something. But that filling is pretty good. And that and the chocolate and the cookie combine really well together. I mean, I, 10. It's a 10. This is a great cookie. I love everything about it. It's not the most sweet thing in the world if you're looking for a sweet treat, but it's it's a nice balance of sweet and cookie. The cookie isn't super sweet. It's kind of like a, like a butter cookie maybe. And it just all combines really well in your mouth. You'll love it. Man, that's a long time since I've given anything other than an Oreo a 10. That's really good. I was not, I, I thought this was going to be like kind of a throwaway product where I was just like, I got nothing to do today. We'll, we'll do this one. But it's not. It is something very impressive. And now my eyes are going to be peeled every time I go to Ollie's because they have so much stuff there that you don't see in other stores or they used to be in other stores. So maybe we'll find a few more things that we can do in the, in the coming weeks. Anywho. Like I said earlier in the video, if you want to donate, Habitat.org is where I would consider my donation going. Thank you guys for checking this one out, though. And if you find yourself at Ollie's and you find those, I would say 89 cents. I'd grab two or three packs, to be completely honest. Then you can share them with all your friends. And if you guys are loving the content I'm creating as much as I love creating the content that you guys are watching, would you please consider subscribing to the channel because it would be... A huge help, a Rooney, for me. Thank you very much. Um, don't forget to make somebody smile today and make yourself a better person tomorrow than you were today tomorrow. Let's make the world spin a little bit happier and a little bit wackier.
together. Let's sing and dance in the sun and in the rain as one, my brothers and sisters. Live life to the fullest and love every moment of it, because you just never know when that last moment's going to come for you. However, never live in fear of that moment. Always live in love, but never let your inner child die. Ooh-wee. Take care of yourselves. Take care of one another, and take care of those around you who cannot take care of themselves, for they are the ones that need it the most. And if no one has told you today that they love you, the vodcast loves you very much, just the way you are. All right, guys, do no harm. I'm Jason Oliveira. This is the podcast, and I'll catch you guys a little bit further on down the road to 50. Take care, my friends, and happy adventuring. Don't go to sleep with a catch it in your pocket. <laughs>